The Golden State Warriors finished off LeBron James and the Cleveland Cavaliers 105-97 in Game 6 of the NBA Finals on Tuesday, capping one of the best seasons in league history. It was the Warriors' first NBA championship since 1975. You know, when I was a five-year-old kid, I watched the Warriors win then. It's been 40 years since. I'm 45 now. This is awesome. Led by league MVP Steph Curry, the Warriors were well known for their shooting prowess throughout the season. And they also managed to rank number one in the NBA in defense, despite playing at the league's fastest pace. It just feels good to say, you know, we're the best team in the world with the best player on the world. This man sitting next Appreciate to my right. It, so it, uh, it's been a journey and man, you know, it can't put into words and I'm so proud of every man on this team, every man in this organization and woman and it's just been a collective effort and we're going to enjoy it tonight, man. We deserve to. Uh, to be able to sit here six years later from a rookie year and, and hold this trophy, this is an unbelievable experience. Um, it just makes it so much more special to have, you know, gone through some lows, gradually work your way up every year, learn some things and um, it all come to fruition with a, with a championship trophy. Warriors forward Andre Iguodala was named most valuable player. He had the unenviable task of guarding LeBron James for the majority of the series. And despite his Herculean efforts, LeBron was not enough to lead the Cavs to victory. I don't know. I mean, for me, it's never a success if you, you go out losing. But um, I think it's, uh, we put ourselves in, uh, you know, back where this franchise need to be, being a contender. Uh, but we got some, we still got a lot of work to do. The city of Cleveland, meanwhile, hasn't won a major pro sports championship since 1964. There's always next year, right guys? It's Cleveland sports. What more can you ask for? We were in the finals. We took it to six. Let's go Cavs!